Very good morning. Yes, continue in John 2 verse 7. Our heading, some principles. Jesus said unto them, fill the water pots with water. Now question, what are the principles involved in our Lord's mode of procedure? Firstly, a rule when Christ is about to bestow a blessing, he gives a command. This is a fact when your memories will help you to establish in a moment. It is not always so, but as a general rule, a word of command goes before a word of power or else with it. He is about to give wine and the process does not consist in saying as many people with it, let there be wine. But it begins by a command addressed to men. Fill the water pots with water. Here is a blind man. Christ is about to give him sight. He puts clay on his eyes and then says, Go to the pool of Siloam and wash. There is a man with his armor swinging at his side, useless to him. Christ is going to restore him. And he says, Stretch forth your hand. Secondly, and the principle goes so far as it's all good in cases where it would seem to be quite inapplicable. For if it be a child that is dead, he says, little young girl, arise. Or if it be Lazarus, of by this time that, that is thinking, being four days buried, yet he cries, Lazarus, come ye forth. And thus he bestows a benefit by a command. Gospel benefits come with gospel precepts. Do you wonder that the principle which is seen in the miracles is seen in the wonders of his divine grace? Here is a sinner to be saved. What does Christ say to that sinner? Believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved. Now, application. Jesus Christ has bidden men to believe and has commissioned his disciples to cry, Repent you, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. The times of this ignorance God winked at, but now commands all men everywhere to repent. And he bids us to go and preach the word, Believe in the Lord Jesus Christ, and you shall be saved. And I pray. O oh, Holy Father, wake us up, wake us up, if everything is there, but that we will catch a wake up, Lord, and begin to be obedient to the command. In Jesus' name, Amen.